go. Oh, Walmart. Hmm. In a different league, and I ain't stupid to your level. What's up, buddy? It's really my means right here, y'all. Where is that blue line coming from? And it's not there. Like, I don't see it. When I come here, I see it. What is that? It gotta be the camera. Just be tripping me out. All right, let's get into it. AMP, I said AMP. SSB, go to therapy. Let's get it. Hi, everyone. This is my first time with a therapist. I went to a therapist in eighth grade. This is my first time. Really? It was in school, though. Like, I had some, they want because we had some family shit. I was like, sorry. Did it help? Dude, like a little bit. Really? No, it did a little bit. That's good. But Elsa, you, you from here, Elsa? Wait, Elsa or Elsa? I like Elsa, but Elsa. Well, of course you But you can, you can stick to Elsa. Of course you think about Elsa. I don't know why I thought I'm that. Nah, he has an ex-girlfriend named Elsa. That's what you're talking about. Stop. Okay, okay. Wait, so Elsa? I'm from Venezuela, originally. Awesome. You was born here? No, that's good. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just yeah. don't want to make sure everyone's in the frame. We good, chat? We're ready to start? Let me know right now. Audio good? Mic good? All right, let's get it. Let's get All right, it. Okay. let's do it. I'll start, though, by saying it's a conversation. Yeah. Yes? Yes. Okay, hopefully a useful one. What do you guys need from me today? So uh, as a, some help. Yeah, some help as a group. Okay. This group's had problems for a long time. Yeah, let's, let's all be real. Girl problems. For a very long time. Okay, yeah. what's the nature of this group? Like, how do you guys become a group? What uh, brings you together? Yeah, we know each other for years. So and just kind of didn't want to, like, start with people, just build with these same people, you know? So, uh... Chaz, is it good or is it low? Just turn the gain up. Yeah. Turn up to four. Should be good. So, okay. basically, we just we built as a group. We just don't want to really build with anyone else. We just all group. You know, I, uh, I've i had, like, a really, really good career. And, you know, I've kind of always had these guys, whether it's in Discord or just kind of been around them, you know, for years. So, I didn't really want to build anyone else. W -mans. I just, like, keep everything like this, you know? Yeah, we basically all do the same thing. We, we stream. All okay. Of yeah. Okay. Yeah. All of your streamers. Yeah. Did you grow up together? I know you've grown no. up. No. I met him and him through 2K. I met him through 2K. And then I met him just, uh, like, a year or two later down the line, like, on on some content stuff as well. Yeah. Okay. And then currently where we're at now, we, uh, we're we just, we're all like up here, now we're all moved down here. We all committed to working together off stream, on stream, to becoming just the best, like of, like the most potential, the, we best, are, the best, best, best version of ourselves, exactly. Okay. They've been the gym. Did you all make that commitment at the same time? Yeah, yeah. 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 we all want to talk about yeah, it, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, Cody. What does Love becoming you, the best version of each of you entail? G on your gym shit, uh, you know, having the best work ethic possible, uh, positive, like being super grinding. positive, grinding. Okay. You guys have other shit you guys want to say too? Yeah. Like, yeah, really just like gym and like trying to string more grinding, like just trying to stay positive. Yeah. Okay. So, where are the troubles? Uh, we, all got, we all got different. Things. Yeah. You want to start first? There's a lot of differences. Um, no, we should start with Shaggy first. Yeah. <laughs> be honest. I got my beard down. Be honest, be honest. Be honest. Like, about everything. And be honest. You're going to be something about yourself, too. Is this taking so what is your question, though? Like, what you, like, what you asking? Well, how would my presence here today be useful to you? Uh, Just trying to see, like, how we could... Like, we, we always talk off stream, like, always on the phone. Like, so to you, though. See how we can, like, do shit, I don't know, like, more together, like, always, like, more communication. And, like, okay. I don't know. Just, like, we're all, stuff we're all like, like hard-headed. We don't listen yeah, to each other, and we, we listen, listen to each other at the same yeah. time. It's weird. Yeah, it's a guess and doll. Uh, yeah, it's weird. Mm -hmm. We're hard-headed, all of us. Okay, so do you find that most of the issues are happening? Give me some background. I know you're all streamers, but do you work together? Do you work separately? I would say it's more together. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Work together. We just lately have okay. all been having issues. And I, I'll be honest, I it's not that I uh, I kind of initiated it, but it's more out of love. It's not out of, like, hate or anything. Like, I don't spite them at all, like, despite them. Like, 
Because at the end of the day, we just want the best for each other. I want what's best yeah. for everybody in this room. Okay. Genuinely. Like, I mean that from the jump, right? Like, I'll give you an example. Like, when I first, like, Kick is my new platform. I said, yo, I'm only coming to Kick if all my boys get deals. That's okay. the only way I'm coming. Like, straight up, I'm not coming to Kick if you don't offer him, 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 him a good deal. Yeah. Okay. And they did. That was from the jump. I was like, yo, this is this is what it you needs to be. And if it's not like this, I'm not doing that. Okay. They came. How come you did that? Tell me about what motivated you to say, I'm not making a move without my boys. It's just more of like a thing where it's, it's just like me. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I don't see myself like, what's, what good is it if I'm the one winning and getting all this money and success if they're also not eating too? When in reality, like, that's how I've always been. I've always been like the type to like include, you know, everyone around me, like on the same shit as I'm on. Okay. So you want your success to kind of permeate into other relationships that are important to you. Yeah. I just want what's best for everyone around me, literally. So oh, in turn, for kind of like propping people up with you, do you have any specific expectations? Respect, the reciprocation of what I what, what I put out, and I would say um, just them being on their shit. I want everyone around me on, on the same shit I'm on, that's it. We are, like, under all. Right, now, when you say, like, respect, like, because you've been saying that, like, a lot. So, like, what you mean like, when you say, like, respect? So, when I had a conversation with both of you before moving both of you out here, I said, yo, you guys, I'll pay for your rent up front for a year. W you man. guys can use the warehouse, whatever you want, my gym, whatever you guys want. W out of man. respect for me. I didn't say it at the time, but I said, all you guys have to do is go live. Go live. That's it. Just go live. You didn't respect that. You didn't respect that. And I was just hurt by that. That's all. I ain't gonna Shut lie. I Him setting y'all up like that. Don't go live. It's pretty crazy. That's all he asked for in return. For you to go live. That's old. Y'all gotta look yourselves in the mirror. That's a I just want. Thing. And now you've been on your. You, you streamed past couple days. I'm happy. And bro, like. Just keep that shit up. That's all I want out of you, just to stream. And what does that do at the end of the day? You're not streaming for me. You're streaming for you. At the end of the day. And you... That's that's true. Like, right? Your work ethic will impact your own life. Mm -hmm. And also, there's an extra layer of complexity, which is that you are intertwined now with his work by virtue of the fact that you brought him in. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then there is an element of, like, there's an expectation that you stream also because, I guess, you're reputation to some degrees on the line because you brought him in. Is that right? Or no, no, 100%. 100%. I okay. just think like when we're all streaming, we're all on our shit, our boss is super happy. He sent me a text yesterday, for example. It was like, wow, bro, like, I, I was happy to see you guys do that stream yesterday. That was awesome. Like, yeah. He came in your chat today. Remember? Like, mm -hmm. He really wants us to all to work together as a unit. Yeah. So if the whole unit is failing, if there's one or two people, I'm supposed to be there on some shit where... I gotta pick that person back up. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, so you I'm, feel responsible. I feel responsible. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. it's hard on me when, like, certain stuff relies on other people that I vouch for heavy many times. You know what I mean? Like, I want everyone around me to be. All they have to do is stream. There's people but that we, like, don't, we're, we don't realize. That's, the potential he's legit. Like, just that's it. But I see it. I see it. So, okay, I hear you. So is it like intimidating? To he's think legit. Of going just live asking now? them to stream. Not intimidating. That's we crazy. just need to strike them with a lot of other things. Well, at least me. Okay. All they listen. It's it's it, it sounds stupid, but it's not the same time because it's a mental job too. But streaming is an easy job. You just have to sit in a chair, play video games, and no, it is. It's super it's easy. easy. People got it way harder. There's people that do construction. There's people that do hard labor. Like, like when you put is, into perspective, I understand what he's hard, saying. Like, yeah. But, but then when you get into the nitty gritty of things, it's not it's not that easy. Like for example, me. Sitting in front of this camera right now, reacting to this, I'm streaming live. I'm on Kick and I'm on Twitch. I have zero viewers in my chat, but I still have to act as though I have a hundred thousand people watching me. That's hard. That is hard. But then when you put it into perspective, we're like, this is your job, and then you got somebody that's like a firefighter or a policeman or a construction worker, like he said. Then you're like, okay. Streaming is easy. So like, I get it. It's all perspective though. The nature of your job, and I wouldn't say that it's easy. It's not. That's I think, easy. I think it, people from the outside may think it's really easy, but I'm starting to understand like. For streaming? Yeah. Mentally it's not easy. Mentally it's not easy. Especially no, the mental. Physically, yes. You're okay, I buy the physical, but the exactly. mental, I don't see it as easy. It's not at all. It's not. I've had a lot of nights I cry. Oh God, there's nights I cry. I oh god <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah. i get death threats hate messages and it's overwhelming sometimes wow. yeah for sure that's crazy sometimes we want to quit 
Yeah, you know. But I think, like that. but that's what happened this past week. I, I, I kind of just had them to. I just kind of like wanted them to call me up on some shit. We talk. I talked to him. I didn't speak to him yet off stream, but that's it. I just said, yo, pay for your your shit up front. Your rent. You don't got to worry about rent. All you got to do is stream. But I have a question for you. Yeah. Um. You said that when you brought them over, you didn't really specifically let them know that all you were expecting was for them to stream. No, they knew that. No, nah, they knew that. We all kind of knew. Like that. they all knew. That's, the whole That's why they're here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, they knew that. Do you? Find that you go silent a long time before you bring it up. And no, I'm vocal about everything. They know that. Right. They know that I'm vocal about every, everything. That's why. Okay. That's why people look at me like I'm crazy or they say like I'm being moody and shit. But yeah, I yeah, he's very vocal. He's very okay. vocal with it. And how does that? What impact does that have on you when he didn't vocalize something when he lets you know? Hey, this is what I'm thinking or this. Is what I mean, I'm okay, feeling. so that kind of backtracks like a month ago. He'll vouch. Back then, I would get really mad when he would do it. Like, we would get in fights, and we wouldn't talk to each other for, like, a couple of days. Yeah. But at the end of the day, it is all about him loving me. It's just, like... He wants the best for y'all. Take me back to two months He's ago. He's basically what paying y'all okay, so y'all can ago, make money for y'all Just think about it a little bit. He's, he's fronting y'all all uh, rent. He's giving y'all a place to stay. And he's just asking you to stream for yourself to make more money for yourself. He doesn't want none of it back. So get in front of your camera and turn it on and stream, y'all. Come on. Facts. We're better on stream. Cause you You're not streaming? That? Yeah. No. Well, yeah, kind of. So he wasn't... I'll, I'll explain my side. I could have been nicer about it, but I tried nice with you. I, I, I tried, yo, cheeser. Bro, just go live. Like, so it wasn't working. So... You, you can admit, yeah. I had to yell at him one night on stream, and he went live because I yelled at him on stream that one night. Mm -hmm. You remember that? So he needs tough love. You're the type of guy that needs the tough love. And I like, I work like that, too. Like, I need the tough love, too. I need to be like... But earlier, yeah, everybody like, needs like, tough love every now and then. Like, it wakes on, you up. Who's that? Because I'm not staying in New York for two more days. You're just going to give up on me? I didn't say I was going to give up on you, Cheezer. I said, I'm going to Explain that. Explain the new, I'll new explain situation. I'll explain it. I'll explain it. And you and you be honest. So these guys right now, them two, these two, they're at a level where they can kind of get to another point in their career where it's like that, that not mainstream, but kind of like there, if that makes sense. Building towards mainstream, right? You're laughing, but Our full I see potential in you. And you're laughing at Our it. full potential. Is what That's saying. it. So I just said a month ago, he was like, yeah, I'll come to New York for you guys for four days because I have a big stream plan out there. But now, since he lost thirty thousand dollars off stream gambling, see, that's true. I don't want to interrupt, but he got me. Look, I, if, I feel like if I stream a lot, there's always something. It's either you, you'll say it's like because I'm trying to get money back. You'll never just actually give me my credit and be like, "Good shit, you're actually streaming." You always have to. So like, wait, wait, wait. But you will, you will. But then right finish. after, you'll throw a little slick shot like he's doing it because he's down. So he's you doing feel? It he's no, no, you no, 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 I, no, no. I just said you lost thirty grand off stream. That's why you're not coming to New York for four days anymore. That's the truth. Comedy We're I, supposed to go to New York as a group. As a group for four and days, I'm, and I am going the whole thing for one day to do the main segment, and then I want to go home and stream and get my hours up. Like what you but, but he could still stream in New York, and he could do streams with, with collaborate with people and bring his career to the next level. If that makes sense. Yeah. What do you think? Mm. About what? Like this situation right here, the New York situation. She needs to hear more of it. Well, um, I think it's difficult to understand when do you start doing for yourself and when do you do for the group. Um, I think every single stream that you do for the group is for yourself. Like I think okay. when you well, went live today, for example, and you had a you had a good stream today, you did. It kind of took me bitching at you and kind of me shouting you out like that. I felt really bad about it, bro. You could ask him and him. I no, he did. I'm bro, like, I was did. I was like emotional. I was like, bro, am I doing Schneidy the wrong way? Like, is this wrong? But it worked, bro. Because guess what? Now you're about to be on your shit. That's an example. Yeah. I had to kind of show you tough love. Right. You're locked in, bro. So, so you remember um, the last conversation we were talking about someone running you? Yeah, the community does. But I stopped. It I, almost sounds like their behavior runs this version of you that is moodier, that doesn't really align with who you want to be. Oh. Um, it sounds to me like you're always trying to start, you know, the nice way. It's true, but and I'll be honest. Somehow the, they take you to a place. The community, the Twitter community, not this chat community. They guess what? Head. They, they, oh. they, they are very negative. So. Them and the, him and him, they were they were just getting hate today. I backed them up. I said, "Yo, fuck you guys. If you're not, if you're, they're on their shit. And yeah. if you have a problem with that, don't watch." That's so mean. Like, we'll, you know we'll, get hate. Is, 
Facts. So I feel that because right now, personally, I feel no, like I'm I'm, I'm in a different mode right. right now. And I, I just cried that. Yeah, then. Like, I could relate to that. I got guns pointed at my face with my girl there. I just need one shot. Don't give me that shot. Yeah, I'll touch the face, though. Yeah, it's up. Yeah, that's the part that makes me know that your job isn't easy. So, do you think we just gotta ignore the community? No. Yeah. Ignore the negative. Hold on, hold on. Um, I'm not an expert on streaming. Like this whole platform is new, so I don't want to give advice over something that I don't know. I understand that this is your career as well, and there's a lot of your reputation on this. So I can't tell you what to do because I really don't know. I will say that I think we can determine the relationship we have with our community. And I like what Aiden said, that there are times where they may say something and you decide not to do it. The negative shit like, I can hear you, but I don't agree. Yeah. And I think both are possible. It's this concept called, like, both and. Mm-hmm. It's not but. It's like, I hear you, but I'm going to do... It's like, both and. I hear you, and also, I think differently. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So there's there's space for both things to exist. Yeah. yeah. That's the idea. Yeah. That's facts. Um, Two things could be right, right at the same time. York thing, Cheezer, it's not to attack you. It's not to shit on you. The past couple of days, I literally said it on stream. She's been on the shit. I'm happy for you, bro. You did back to back ten hour stream. I'm so happy for you, but it makes me upset when you don't want to keep increasing your potential, and you're never gonna go to New York ever again, bro. So the fact that you made it a one day trip instead of a four day trip just because you lost money off stream, it, it it honestly hurts me because it's like I want what's best for you and I want to push you to the best version of Cheezer as a creator, you know. And we're all going as a group, so it'll be better if we all go as a group. Yeah. That's all. But I'm not gonna make you feel bad about it anymore. And I apologize. That is, it is a manipulation tactic, but it works. I told you that one night it made you feel I'm like shit. to get him manipulated. It works though. But it, it hurts me. I won't do it. I'll, I'll be soft on you. But then I don't like that. See, and then you make me feel bad for you being soft on me. I mean, the manipulation shit works. The tell like, like, for him and it worked for you. All right. You so you now, you, how do you, hold you on. said you felt terrible. From his perspective now, from Aiden's perspective, it's like, so what do you want me to do? You want me to be hard on you? You want me to be soft on you? I'll be hard on you and I'll manipulate you into doing it. You don't like it. I'm soft and you're like, all right, I'm going to fall back. You don't like it. Like, what you want him to do? You got to look at it from both sides now. You need to, like, be tough. What? Because I'll, I'll try being good to them first. Like, yo, you know, geez, just go live, bro. You're wasting your potential and shit. It doesn't work. They don't go live. And then I scream and then it works. So I have a question. Talk to me about consequences. Anyone. When you guys think about your work, Mm-hmm. As streamers, mm-hmm. what are the consequences for not showing up? Falling off. Yeah. Falling off. There was a there was a part where they all support. there was a part where people did not get resigned, almost did not get resigned. Is your signing contingent I, upon theirs? N- not me. They they're in their own group though. They're okay. so it's me. I'm in my own lane. They're in their own lane as a group. Yes. Okay. Not because it's my choice. Because it's the boss's choice. Yeah. So. There is a point where he was very skeptical about re-signing certain people in this room. And I would always constantly vouch for like, nah, give him one more month to prove themselves. Give him, you know. Man, during that month, us, during that month we all went crazy. We all streamed a lot. I fought for them. I said, just give him one more month. Let we them, all went crazy. Let, yeah. let them prove. Let them show. Let them do it. Yeah, that's a, that's a triangle where essentially you're caught in the middle between your boss and them and kind of like. Yeah. Advocating, and that's exhausting. I feel and weird. I think that that yeah. exhaustion is what takes you to a place of being, like, too hard. He's or, putting himself on the like line, basically, and it's like they're not respecting them. Them. Yeah. I could see that part. Your essence. He's putting himself boss out or there a friend. for That's why I'm going to have my manager just start handling, like, the business internal shit, because now that him and the boss are connected like, like this, so I'm not even going to... By that, I, I, I don't think... Don't feel bad, but I'm just not... I'm not going to be on you about work and content and stuff. I'd rather much value as, as as friends like i'm not gonna push you unless you this come feels to me genuine this. but i do just like want this best for you 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 they you, getting everything right? out and if you take it the wrong way i don't need it for that i just want to see us as a unit be be the be the best okay hold on real quick that's it Company w video boom yeah. no, w video feel like um the side boom. of streaming shit like as far as like um friends and groups i feel like we all need to respect each other equally and we need to like not show like like a different like not treat a different person a different way like not even just like Aiden just like everybody in the group like I feel like that's what we gotta do first and then that's when the streaming stuff come naturally like I feel like would that be make us more like, you know we'll be more better like, chemistry stuff. yeah better like you know better you know like I just feel like and then I just feel like uh, another thing like 
one thing I can say about uh, Aiden, like the managers he's working with, like all his recent managers never respected us individually. Like if, um, if, me, if like I say, me and Aiden, like we all friends. Like yeah. the, the managers, they don't know us. They don't. They just came around because you know he blew up. So like if Aiden's like yeah, if me and Aiden going through something which is between us, like and like I say like his ex manager or something, they always just be like yeah like smoke them like fuck them like you know whatever. And I just feel like you know that's just not like. I feel like it just respect, like, you know, right. respect equally goes a long way. So. so when a third person gets in the mix, like a manager or something, you yeah, feel yeah. threatened? Basically, he's saying that. You feel disrespected? Yeah. By like, Aiden or by the other person? He was there first, basically. Like, this friendship run deeper than that manager connection. So it's like, why that manager is giving his two cents? They're like, your two cents not worth anything here. I get that. I get that. I get that. Well, it just, I just feel like he, uh, like, if you look up to somebody, he let them get in their ear, like, he let that person get in his ear, and then, you know, and then that's when he'll start acting a certain way. Not because how he mm -hmm. want to act like that. So he's influenced by someone else? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I mean, yeah, I guess you could say that, but we all get easily influenced. Like, we all young, you know what I'm saying? We all in our 20s, like, you know, so, like, Do you we, feel uh, like he's been working on that, or no? Um, honestly, yeah, he's been working on it more, but I just still feel like it just still always, problem. like, like he always say, you always say we gotta respect you. Like, you don't even know. Like, uh, well, I ain't gonna speak for everybody, but like me personally, like, I actually genuinely respect you. Like, respect you, respect you, appreciate you, everything you do. Like, even everybody, I respect It's like you. it's no way you can. You. Like, like look at the position he's equal. putting y'all in. It's, it's, it'll be hard not to. Yeah. So um, I just feel like we just gotta rec recuperate that. Like, everybody get the same love. Everybody get the same respect. Wait, can I ask you? Wait, so what did Tav do this time? Because I don't, you know, I've known Tav for four years, five years. Yeah. Before no, he was my manager. I ain't really saying like. Tom, and Tom, honestly, bro, about Tom, yeah. he, he, he honestly saved me, bro. I was in a, I was crashing, bro. Like, no, nah, I'm not talking really about, that's shit. why I said ex-managers. I'm, I'm not talking about, like, Tom. I'm talking about, I ain't gonna say the name, but, you know, you can't say the name, whatever. But in this yeah. current, in this current situation, this like, current situation, it was, it was, like, I ain't gonna say it was, like, a, it was a bad situation where, like, Tom did something, but, like, it was just on some shit, like, um, like he was just saying like, oh, well, we don't respect you and stuff. My like, I just feel like I nobody can say how how I am. Like you may respect me other ways, but if if our agreement that we had was, yo, I'm moving you guys out to Miami. You guys got this up front. You could use my equipment. All you have to do is stream. It's disrespectful yeah. to me, and it's kind of overstepping, if that makes sense. Nah. So here's the thing. I think we're having a conversation that is mixing fact and feeling. Mm. So when we talk about respect, um, I mean. Well, I That's guess respect deep. is tricky because there are some factual ways that you can, like, disrespect someone. Mm -hmm. But I think when you guys are talking about respect in the context that I can understand is you're, you're talking about, like, a feeling when in reality you're also talking about, like, facts. Are you streaming or not streaming? Tell That's, like, the yeah. fact of the job and the agreement. Yeah. And then if you do or don't, is that the same as respecting or disrespecting someone? In other words, can I maybe be failing at my contract or agreement? and also respect someone because i feel like that's what you're saying maybe i'm not streaming yeah. and i still respect it's, Aiden. Yeah. well yeah. i feel like well, I'm, I'm, what i I'm feel like, like yeah. about that is it's disrespectful to aiden to not stream because he's putting himself on the line for you so it's like a slap in the face to aiden that's the disrespectful part. But at the same time, he's appreciative of Aiden for putting him in the <clears throat> position that he's in. So now, if he doesn't do what he's required to do, that falls back on him and not Aiden. That's what I'm getting from. That's what I'm getting from. She maybe I should. Mm. Nah, I ain't gonna say. I ain't gonna lie. Like I got here, like I said, January. Oh, so since I've been here, I ain't gonna say. I ain't gonna lie. Say I was like the most consistent streamer and stuff. But I will say, like, um, like I was, like I didn't get down here and not like just sell my ass and just smoke weed and shit. Like you know, um, we so far we did a lot of shit. Like we had a lot of uh, banger streams together. Like we had a lot. We went to Vegas. We did. We like we did a shoot for the for some shit that's dropping. Like. I feel like we did a lot of shit together so far, and it's only been like what a month, a month, yeah, just a month, two only months. a month. Well, a month since you've been here, yeah. Literally only a month, yeah. and I just feel like, um, like yeah, I wasn't the best streaming, but I still did some stream. Like I was still streaming, you know, I was getting to it, you know, I was just finding myself as a streamer. And uh, what I think is like, 
what he like just said is, is so facts yeah, and i don't think i gotta rewind it because that's a bar i don't think people understand that part when it comes to streaming i did some streaming like, i was still streaming you know i was getting to it you know i was just finding myself as a streamer and finding yourself as a streamer not every streamer is the same not every streamer is going to want to stream the same stuff play the same game like you got to find your own lane and that could take a while trust me bro like i'm now getting comfortable in my own lane with this like i know what i want to do how i want to do it and like but that took a while bro i've been trying to get after this for years mind you i'm talking like i don't made it i'm still nowhere in this but just in my own space my own lane i feel comfortable and i'm content with where i'm at as a streamer i feel him on that that's a bar that's a bar you know what i think is like i feel like everybody is a different streamer you get what i'm saying like, i feel like i feel like the, i feel like the community or like just like people in general just try to push everybody to be the same in a way. like um uh, aiden jr like i'll say it like that like, everyone's their own everyone's their yeah, own like, yeah. i feel like so who are you as a streamer tell me about what that's, you bring to the table yeah see that's why like me as a streamer streamer like an individual streamer like me as cuff and like no, nobody else in the group like that's what i'm still like working on finding like you know i'm still and take like, your time with that honestly. i was a streamer streamer so I was, like uh, gta rp streamer like, i see what's going on i see what's going on he doesn't want to spark up a stream if he don't know what he's going to do or what he wants to do. Because then that is kills the quality of the stream. I feel you. I feel you on that. I feel you. Okay. So um, that game died. So, you know, um, now I'm still like we're finding. trying new things. Right. Yeah, we're trying new things. I'm still trying to find where's my hitter at. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. His niche. Everybody got, it, got their, own, the their own niche. Like not niche, niche, nice. whatever you want to call yeah. it. Everybody yeah. got that their own lane. And, and I do remember from our last conversation. That got to find it. Sometimes it, it takes longer than others. That's the thing I want to. I don't want to. I don't want to discredit him for it. It's true. Like he was here for that stream. He comes. He shows out yeah. for streams and stuff. He does, and I give that the flowers all the time for that. But you know, I just I want what's best for you and you, and I want you guys to get to that money and get to you know feel in again. W man, we went live before that. You know, stream and then just stream. I stream kind of like what you and you are doing right now. Or not you right now, sorry. What he's doing right now. It still counts towards your hours. You're still getting paid. You're still making everyone happy. And it's good content. It's great content. Great, great content. content. Love, love the content. Shit. They love to see us all together. They want to see us. Not the bank. He's That's been it. on a roll lately. You know, who's good? Like, who's good? Like, our, like, bro. What do you think gets in the way? What gets in the way of... Ourselves? Like, losing ourselves? Oh, okay. Yeah. Is it something personal stuff that goes on for each of you or is it like the tension no, it's just like if some shit going on like because there's been so much shit going on like if something going on well like, i'll be trying to stay out of the way so if something going on then i just back off here yeah. like between you guys and i'm just saying like in general like for the four years like we've been in a group i'm just saying like if something going on i'm just back off like i don't even want it to explode or nothing like i'm just like, like let them handle that so, yeah if something going on then i just and that makes sense you know, not so picking a side when when you think of anxiety and I'm not talking anxiety like, oh, I have a big, you know, mm -hmm. show tomorrow or whatever. Anxiety as in like pressure, tension or whatever. There are some ways that we automatically deal with it. Some people resort to like distance. You're saying, I'm trying to stay away. Yeah. I don't want to be there. So I distance myself. Yeah. And that may prevent you from like streaming because you're like, mm -hmm. I just don't want to even touch that. Yeah. Um, another one is with conflict, yeah. right? And another one, th there's a couple different ones, right? But what I think is the best idea is when you can say, let me stay connected to the group and think for myself. So, mm -hmm. you know, the idea is to continue to be in tune with what you're thinking and what your personal needs are while also paying attention to the group. Yeah, sure. So yet. what do you think that would look like for you? You're noticing tension here and your automatic reaction is to like stay away. Mm -hmm. If you could do it a little differently, what would you do? Like talk it out. It's a tough question. Like, okay. So have, what, like, would you text the group, or would you text, or, or like call Aiden, or what would you do specifically? Either like either what like if it's a group problem, we deal with it as a group. Or if it's something between me and him, we mm -hmm. watch it me and him. Okay. Yeah. It's really just communication. I feel like like when you and Aiden talk, you guys always fix the problem so fast. Every yeah. time you actually like yeah, we were cool. We fixed the last night. Every time they sit down and talk, the problem gets solved in a second. It's just he's always. You? Norman. What? What is your go-to? 
What is my what? Like when you so get into a problem. Like, do you, do you oh. take distance? Uh, or you want to like confront it? You want to be like honest? Yeah. I mean, I just, if like, you want to. It's a safe space. Smoke weed and lay in bed. Okay, so you and disconnect. Yep. That's like cut off. Yeah. Let me um, disengage from what's going yeah. on. Yeah, that's what I do, yeah. But then you wake up and the weed effect, you're not high anymore. Yeah, nothing changes. It's a bad, it's right. a toxic cycle because then I wake up and I feel like shit. Facts. I can relate to that. I'm for real. Steven? Yeah, I can relate to that. That's fact. Tension? Anxiety? Shit. To be honest, I just, I don't know, I just go in my own zone and I just ignore a lot of shit. I just be to myself. Avoidance? Yeah. You know what takes up so much energy? Avoiding. Yeah, I try to avoid Pretending as much Pretending something can. isn't happening is one of the most... Well, I feel like I'm part of this. Yeah, I try to ignore a lot of shit. I feel like I'm in the room with, with them. Cuff them? What? Like I'm on the chair oh, right I, there. Him, like I'm we, sitting we, next we to the convo. Yo, what up, bro? You cocoon away from the rest of the group. Yeah, we just be together because every time something happens, we, we be together. Like we be out yeah. together. So shit. We just, you know, be around each other, stream with each other, you know, talk off stream. Um, I feel like we should, like, uh, we should definitely, like, like uh, another person, I like, swear to God, uh, Aiden said that he. He went up and talked to him, but you know he he called you up. I feel like we should have um we should have been on some stuff like that this time instead of just yeah. like doing yeah. out. Yeah. 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 Sweater hit me and you lost me with that. Sweater. Life. So sweater hit me because his hours were low. Like I think for, since the start of the year, January first. Is sweater a person? Sweater's a uh. He's in our group. Adrian. Group. Call Adrian. Adrian. He's in our group. Sweater. Uh, group. Adrian. Sweater. Since the start of the year, I think it showed a statistic. I'm like eighty two percent. He's thirty percent. He's thirty percent on like streaming day, like thirty percent of the whole year streaming since like January first. Uh, I think Sweater was also thirty, but he, he talked right away like, "Yo, bro, like, fuck it, like, I'm gonna just start streaming everything." I was like, "Let's go!" Like the day after, that I was like, "Yo, like, it's disrespectful, guys. Like, get under shit." He, he was started, just started, he was just yeah. quick to do it the next day, mm -hmm. Sweater, and he's just been live, you know, doing it. So I ain't gonna lie. I think the reason like how shit happened this time was like because how it happened. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. how it happened and how like, how um, um, like, now I'll touch base on it. Yeah. So look, here's what happened. That day where I started spazzing at everyone, I had, um, say I got a taste of your medicine too. I'm gonna bring it up, which you and I spoke on. And so look, I got docs that day, meaning that like I already had people, police pulling up to our shit. So we're, we're working on moving right now, me and him, and um, so. I had got docs that day, and I had police show up and shit, so, you know, I was just already really fucking pissed about the stress where I gotta move now, and I keep a lot of personal belongings there and shit, and, um, so I had to figure out where I was gonna move at, so I was really uptight as it was, and I don't know what, what caused it in me just to be like, fuck, bro, like, I think you said to someone on, stream, on yeah. stream, and it, like, made the community pissed off, and then, like, then, like, I was just fucking mad, and I was like, bro, like, fuck, and then it's just... It just got, it just all kind of just let out there. Yeah. Like, like, the thing is that when we're not, okay, for whatever reason, on a personal level, it's when you have a lot going on, um, like the police showing up and having to move or whatever other stressors we have, I guess you become more reactive. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And so I think maybe that took you to a place of dealing like, with this, not in an Like, I had it in my head the whole time, like, damn, like, why are they not streaming? Like, every day they are by me, like, why is this person not live? Why is this person not live? There's percentages, why they're not and live? And to be fair with you, you have brought it up because I know that just in our last conversation. Yeah. Came up. They know. I mean, know. everyone knows that I want to go live. Um, so I just kind of let out right there. I was like, damn, all right, now I'm really mad at this person. So now, like, damn, like, that's on some respect shit. Why are you not live? Why are you not streaming? And, um, yeah, like, I'm over that shit. We're moving. I'm in good spirits when it comes to that. I'm calmed down from that. But, you know, in reality, I still want everyone going live. And, by the way, thank you for calling me. And we talked and we fixed it. And I really appreciate the conversation we had because the day after you came and you did your thing, you streamed today. I'm really, really happy and proud of you, bro. That was a great stream. Oh, yeah. So. Would you be willing to, like, not advocate for them anymore and, like, suffer the consequences of not streaming? I just feel bad. I feel like I, like li literally, yeah. If I stop, like, kind of vouching for them, and I just kind of I know it's gonna let them do their own thing, and let them talk to like I'm, I'm, I'm the boss directly and stuff. I really think by now, I'm sorry, guys, but I think by now some of your guys' deals would have been lost. No, yeah, for sure. No, yeah. Last year, you know what I mean? Like last year during that one time we got all that talk, no, yeah. I think you guys would have, some of you guys would have lost your deals, but yeah. 
I just don't feel right about that. Like, at the end of the day, he's got a family, he's got a family, he's got a family, he's got a family, and yes. I'm all for people taking care of their people, you know, like. Yes. But. So, and to be honest, he shouldn't be feeling bad for us. We should, like, handle our own stuff, you know, grind. Uh, so. That just speaks on his character. is really part, is, it's a huge, important part of, like, being a group, right? And knowing that you yeah. can count on someone for their support. Yeah. But that's different than, like, carrying other people. So. Like a metaphor that I really like to think about is like being an anchor or like a life, uh, like a buoy, I guess. You know, mm -hmm. if too many people are like pulling down the buoy, everybody can kind of sink, mm -hmm. right? But if you're an anchor, it's like, I'm here to help you if you want to step up. Yeah. Right? Like I'm anchored and I'm a resource to everyone and I want to support you. Let me know if you want to make use of that. Mm -hmm. As opposed to like I'm trying to keep everyone afloat and we're all kind of sinking together. Yeah, yeah. but you know, I, I think here's my that's thing why with that metaphor. Stepping back and letting here's my thing. An anchor keeps everybody afloat, but that anchor is the only one underwater drowning. Think about that for a second. A floaty could only save so much people. When too much people is on the same floaty, the floaty sinks, and so does everybody around. The anchor is going to make sure everybody stays afloat. The boat and everything. You're cool. I'm I'm keeping us still. We're solid. But that anchor is underwater. Who's helping the anchor? Don't let that go over your head, y'all. Top come in and just kind of like being my manager and just kind of like letting them do their own thing. And he's going to help bring deals. If you want someone, he'll help you get someone. If you want to do something in your career, help you do something in your career. It was Tav's idea to be like, yo, I'm dropping merch. It was Tav, I'm dropping like merch. It was Tav's idea to be like, yo, let's get all your boys codes. Like, let's let them promote it. And Code Cuff and Coach Nagy, Coach Heezer, let's let them make some money off this shit too. You know what I mean? So that was Tav's idea um, to let them all eat off the merch. Yeah. Um, and I think and like, I'm going to let him just kind of handle everyone else's stuff on the business side because I don't want to do it anymore, honestly. And I was thinking that in you stepping back, um, there's also an opportunity for you guys to step up for each other as a group. Because yeah. like right now it seems like you step up for everyone, but I'm wondering how you guys show up for each other as a group. Now we help each other up with like streams and stuff. Like I'll go to his stream, he'll right. come to my okay, stream, cool. he'll go to his stream, we help each other yeah. out like yeah. that. That's awesome. Yeah, we do together all the time. Okay. okay. Like, uh, I will say Tom is definitely one of his best managers, like morally. Like uh, okay. he's one of the first people that actually felt like, um, like he actually cared about other people besides just Aiden in the way, you get what I'm yeah. saying? And I mean, it, I think if you know Aiden at all, you know that you need to take care of his people because that's at your core. That's it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. So like a good manager will recognize that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, that's what I'm saying. So yeah, that's like, all the previous issues we had, we shouldn't even never have them. You get what I'm saying? It was just yeah. other people. Just, you know, no, I agree. Like last year, we all had a fallout, and that was like due six to months. It was like six. That months. was due. That was due. Really? That was due to a manager in Miami like get away from them basically for no. Re I mean, it wasn't for no reason, yeah, was but it could have been solved. You were really yeah. easy to get in the ear, but I think you're getting better at that. Definitely, but and it could have been solved. And it could have been solved just with a phone call. You know what I mean? Yeah. Citrus, my door ash. Citrus, my door ash. <laughs> How do you know <laughs> if you're thinking for yourself? Or if you're thinking, <laughs> oh, there it is. Okay, Citrus. Thank you. God damn, Six seconds. Get that was fast. Oh, what the oh, fuck? Oh, Don't put Citrus in the <laughs> chat. Let's count. Let's count. <laughs> Let's count. And it could have been solved. And it could have been solved just with a phone call. You know what I mean? Yeah. Citrus, my daughter. He said it at 32, 34. 32, 34. He said it. Citrus, my daughter. Crazy. <laughs> How do you know if you're thinking for yourself or if you're thinking, oh, there it is. Okay. And then he came at 32, 44, 10 seconds. Get that boy a raise. Get that boy a raise. Stop playing with him. God damn, damn it. It's like a chat. What the fuck? He flew downstairs and walked away. Oh, my God. I need a fork. Fork. You heard a fork, a fork, water, two fork. Three Mississippi. Yo, <laughs> two Mississippi. Seven Mississippi. Bro. Eight yeah, Mississippi. I... Nine Mississippi. So, Aiden, how do you ten know if you're thinking for uh, yourself I thought he was going to beat ten. 
What are like the markers? Of, like, it's different now. Like I, I yell at Tom. Him and I were just screaming at each other the other day for some stupid shit. Like I yell at him. I talk back to him. I'm not afraid of him. I don't. I don't care. Is he in water? No. Oh. He doesn't work. <laughs> what are you saying? So oh, sorry. I don't want to be rude and eat right now. Um, but it's different. Like I'm still easily influenced, persuaded, but now I'm starting to give less of a fuck. Like the Twitter community, yeah, for example. Yeah, if, he had if they want to sit here and say that. Like, Talk shit about him or him. I'm gonna if stick up for him. I don't care. Hmm. And uh, like before, you wouldn't have been able to. <laughs> no, I wouldn't get right into it. Be like, all right, sorry, community. Like, like, how do we like make them happy? But I don't. Yeah. Because guess so what? Sometimes They're, maturity has to do with like standing up for what's important. That's it. You just gotta stand up for when you know you yeah, know you're valuable. You're valuable. You guys don't know. I'm gonna keep reassuring you that you're valuable and you're valuable and what? let yeah, them I hate. I appreciate you saying that today. I'm sure. Have yeah, my back. Oh, that, that was nice. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's well, we should just, you know, um, this recent issue, we should just, I want to just get back on track, you know, I want to yeah. be good, I want to have fun, track, and like, was, I'm a goofy track. person, so me being like this serious, not laughing and stuff, it just You scared me. me today when you walked in, I was like, who is this guy? Yeah, I haven't seen you, like, I mean, I, I've only yeah. ever met yeah, him yeah. one other well, time, look, but I was when like. When you do look like that, he is a very scary human. So. <laughs> 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 oh, come here. <man. laughs> no, you seemed off. We all love each other so much, I feel like just dumb little shit gets dragged so much. For no reason. And it shouldn't ever be dragged when well, it's something like... I mean, when you say dumb little shit, that's probably the content, you know, like... It's not dumb little shit, you sure. It's, it's like what's underneath it that waits. It's like, not like... Can I ask you guys all a question? If you weren't streaming, what would you do? That's a great question. What would you do if you weren't streaming? Be honest. It is right now. Like, right now, if you just lost your pick deal, what would you do? I mean, I quit, right, I quit baseball for streaming, so I'll probably still try and be doing that. But right now, if, if I wasn't playing baseball... I'd probably be homeless, I'm going to be honest. Right, like, okay. I'd be, be working at McDonald's, so I'm going oh. to be dead ass, bro. Dude, I was working at Smoothie King before, yeah, like, yeah. I thought, like, on God. Yeah. That's what it was. I was making smoothies. So you still some smoothies? Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I, I got free one every day, on God. All right, Tyler, what would you do if you weren't streaming? Be honest. I mean, I was just, you know, um, back in hometown, you know, I was just following my, my dad's footsteps. Because, I mean, I was already influenced, you know, I was already, like, given opportunity, which is, like, you know. What's your dad's footsteps? Um... So he was a five star athlete. No, I'm just he told me he, he was basically like you know distributing, selling you know different things you know. So um, I definitely would have you know been doing that. Which by the way, I'm not putting this out there, but he's the one who told me that whenever you go down that route, eventually there's two things that you're gonna get from it: it's either death or jail. Oh, yeah. Straight up, bro. You can never be like a f- every time. It's gonna catch up to you, bro. And that's just how it is. And and yeah. you know, okay. So I'm glad you admitted that, though. What are you? What would you do if you weren't a streamer? Shit, I got two. Either a construction worker or soccer didn't work out, but if soccer worked out, I would have been a professional soccer player. I feel like they probably not gonna believe me, but I feel like I could have been a professional soccer player. You was that nice, guy. I feel like uh, you're I hear a the team, conviction. I hear the but conviction. like in the United States, I would have definitely. I feel like you was that nice. I, yeah, I feel like I was nice. And too. you, Norman? Nah, I gave that Norman. sport up. Um, <laughs> I would. Pro- no, you're good. I would probably just move back to Indiana and do fraud and invest in real estate a little bit and do scamming, like. That's what I'll do. I'm being honest. I'll be real. And I love that question. Oh, that, that is a real question. Yeah. I'd be a scammer for sure. <laughs> just being honest. I ain't nobody that scammer shit, bro. Bro, I ain't nobody that shit, bro. I'd put you on. Really I could, I could really, really good. No, yeah, yeah, I'll make a lot of money from it. But eventually, we'd go to jail. 100%. It's inevitable. <laughs> so it's just like yes. selling weed. It's, no. it's just like selling stuff, huh? Yeah, but you'd go I mean, to jail. But if you sell stuff, you could be nah, a king. Nah, that's just happy. You could be like a chopo. You could be like one of the... Shit. You'd be rich. You'd be fed up. Yeah, you could, you know... That could be successful in a way. No, but what seriously, is this? I love that question because it brings me back to this idea of like being very clear about consequences. What are the consequences for you guys not respecting really yourselves or like taking advantage of the opportunity that you have at hand? It is. That's it. This is more, I like how you said that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This is more than just like how you treat or not treat Aiden. It has to do with really like for you. You guys yeah. taking advantage of a platform that changes day, your life. It's all love. We're the ones getting affected. You know what? Sure. I could have easily just been like, "Fuck this! I'm not vouching for any of these guys. Let them lose their shit. Let them go to what they were just saying, and that's that." But morally, as a person, I don't feel like that's a good thing to do. You know? Right, Why are you laughing? Because I mean, you're right. 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 If I would have lost my deal, that. I, mean, when, I probably lose it. I probably wouldn't be here right now. I'm just be honest. Would you still be? Hey, I'm gonna be honest. Would you still be streaming? Hey, yo, straight away. <laughs> 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 Smoothie recipe. <laughs> 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 no, but I didn't mean that as insult. Like, there's probably a huge market of, like, 
I need you ideas for my kids. I didn't mean that as an insult. No, you good. You good. <laughs> <laughs> You only want to vape, vape. Cause, bro, whenever I see cheese, I hit his vape. Oh, God. Oh, God. What is that on your shorts? Paint. Uh, How long have you been a therapist for? Um, let's see. I got my started my practice 2020, I want to say. So, 40, close oh, to four okay. years. Yeah. You like it? I love it. That's fine. I love it. it. Keeps my life really interesting. Yeah. Nah, I can tell. <laughs> this this is very, yeah, very interesting. Everything fucked up. <laughs> and I know no, you feel good about yourself, too. Well, yeah. you know, it's interesting because, like, sometimes you don't really know what people take from it. Yeah. I mean, not sometimes. Most of the time you don't, unless someone yeah. tells you. Um, and when they do, it can be really significant. But I do it, you know. I love it, yeah. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. No, yeah, I just, no, I just, I'm just glad, you know, we had this talk, cause um, when the call, when, when the call was ringing last night, I was like, I was just zoned out, like I didn't, I didn't talk to you on the phone last night when, you, when, when the call rang. I tried calling you last night. Yeah, I know, I know, that's what I'm saying. Like, no. So I was, I was just zoned out, and I was just like, thinking, what about what? Hold on, chat. I'm gonna be right back. I need you to don't follow me, Cody. It is what it is, or it is what it isn't. It's for me, Coach, then not for you. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I'm still here, but I gotta have my cam. I gotta eat, bro. I gotta pick up. I ain't even gonna lie to you. I'm starving. I'm not gonna say that I'm gonna reach out to fix it. He hit me up earlier in that day. What's the word? So. Right, I was streaming, so I, I called him back, basically, you know? Yeah. So we, we were both trying to fix it, and, you know, it, it's all right, bro. We'll talk off stream after this, obviously, but, you know, that's it. I just want everyone to stream. It's not even just for me. It is it is disrespectful, but it's also disrespectful to themselves. I like how you put it like out like that. It's true, because yeah. this opportunity, any one of these people would, honestly, someone die. would die for. Yeah, do um, die. It's a on. blessing, man. It's, it's a fucking blessing. Hold on. Are you kidding? Cause that's facts. Hold on. That's facts. Say it twice so I know you meant it. It is disrespectful, but it's also disrespectful themselves. I like how you put it like out like that. It's true because yeah. this opportunity, any one of these people would. Honestly, someone die. would die for it. I'm it anyone. For it's a blessing, man. It's a, it's a fucking blessing. I'm a, anyone. Are you kidding? All you have to do is sit in that Fact. fucking chair and click start streaming. It's fucking insane. Like, come on. It is insane. Oh, you guys Think about it, bro. Five or six days out of the week. Y'all in a crazy position. Y'all got to take money. advantage of that, like, bro. Carry that impulse forward. Can I, can I tell you? Yeah. Tom's going to get them contracts starting March 1st that if they're not live, they don't get paid. And they'll be thanking me. They'll be mad at me at first, probably, but... And a year from now, when they have a nice amount of money in their bank account, they'll, they'll be thanking me. You know, okay. um, I'm Where not handling it. That goes important. for all of us because we all slack. Like even me, like with our stream, we all slack. Yeah. Okay, so there's a plan in place. March first. Mm -hmm. That's my birthday. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday! Happy yeah. early birthday! Happy early birthday! March first coming up. What do you about think about February being the shortest month? Why do black people get the shortest month? Black, uh, yeah, it is. Um, that's unfortunate. <laughs> no, it, it's 
it's unfortunate that it it's the, the shortest. <laughs> Yeah. This year, there's a 29th. It's a leap year. Yeah. Oh, so you're good. You're nigga, it's 31 days, nigga. Not 29. We're not the or shortest anymore. Yeah, so what do you call Like, you want the biggest month, too? Nigga, yeah. I want a full one. Not the shortest one. Yeah, I want, everything. Yeah, I want, I want everything. everything. I want everything, bro. And that's why 21 Savage and Playboy Cardi see, and this is where it starts. Okay. See, this is how it starts. That's how it starts. Yeah. Yeah. starts. Yeah. Thank you, Cheezer. It's how it starts like this every time. It's fine. We just trolled. Did you ask me something earlier? Oh, what are you going to do for your birthday? Fuck. Hopefully, I'm going to make it to Miami Slice and have me some pizza. Oh, have you guys been to Miami Slice? No, I've never heard of that. I can't eat. We can't eat. We can't eat. We're all diets. I lose about five pounds. Well, I can eat. Well, I don't know about pizza. Anybody should have Miami Slice. It's good. It's good? Yeah. It's like around downtown. It's okay. Wait, it's close to here? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's good. They got healthy pizza. Uh, What is that? A healthy pizza? You got like some, some yeah. vegan, something healthy, yeah. vegan cheese, no bread, something. Yeah. Vegan cheese, no bread. Uh, pizza. Uh, they have pizza. Uh, they have pizza. Uh, they have pizza. They have pizza. Ginger shot. Ginger. I mean. Ginger. Oh. Do you have another one? You want it? Okay. I like ginger too, though. So. Do it over the bag. Wait. Yeah. That's a big one. Chill, Cody. Chill, Chill Cody. Cody. We've never seen cheese do this. See? Oh, my life, I've, take, I've been taking I thought like we said a lot. Yeah. Yeah, I thought like we said a lot. <laughs> what? <laughs> wait, wait, what? Take it away, right man. Oh. <laughs> Plus, that's the ones I get. Oh, God. Just drink it. You got it. That? It's the best thing for you. I need to. Good for your body. Oh, you should put Texas Street. I love ginger, ginger or too. Or do I look like a normal guy? Just, like, be honest. No weird really? way. Like, well, do I, I like know you guy? look mostly like you just got out of bed. Like, sleepy. That's fine. Like yeah, you're wearing valid. pajamas, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I don't look sick though. I, I have a problem. Like not nourish. I feel like that. Um. No. Thank you. I, I have a problem. Yes. But I don't know if you can help me. I don't know either. I say the word nigga too much, and now I don't know how to stop. Is there um, a way where you know how to stop saying a word or not? Yeah, they just gotta beat the hell out of you. When did you start saying that? Since I was a kid. How do you That's how I grew like, up. What? So you were okay. saying nigga with a ponytail? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, literally. Yeah, that's context, crazy. How did you grow up? Since I was saying since like a nine years old. You went to a private school. No, I did not. Ooh. No, she's talking to me. Bro. I grew yeah, up. Let's let them talk. Well, I grew up in Hialeah. I don't know how. It's not like the hood hood, but it's not like a good spot. But yeah, right. since a kid, I've always been saying it. And like now when I grow up, people think it's like a racist thing. I don't know. I just, they say it. I say it a lot. So I already know. How to, I don't know how to stop. Hmm. It's tricky. I'd have to think about it more, but... I want to get more professional, you know? I don't want to say it. There, you say it? There's like a, a you could have, like, a little rubber band. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, you nigga give me the ball, nigga. Because he played soccer when he was little. He's been saying it since he was little, so, like... Yeah, like, how do you feel about school, basketball? Like, like, like when I go to school, yeah, after school, you never had black friends. Yeah, you, like you when girl, I skip school, what? You was around. You know what type of friends I had, bro? No, you told me. I met your you friends. No, they're, you all, they're all Mexican. You I met my friends when I was twenty-one years old, bro, not, or twenty. You did not meet my friends. I met your friend like no, I was a jit, bro. Yeah. No, he's Mexican. So one option? Yeah, he's Mexican. Is that you have like a little rubber band, and whenever you hear yourself say it, like you snap it. Do that. Nah, seriously. That's a good idea. Have a rubber band. Because then it brings like that awareness. That, and it, I think I'm gonna get like a shock collar and put it on myself, and every time I say, it, I just shock myself. So do it. That's, That's like a the only little extreme. I do not recommend that, that personally, but yeah. Because you know it's wrong, otherwise you wouldn't even have brought it up. I don't think it's wrong. You think it's wrong? Well, no. That's what I was. I mean, I don't want to. I want to stay away from saying if it's wrong or right, but I understand yeah. that there are certain behaviors that Be make honest. sense culturally. Have you said it? No. Time? So like, listen, in Venezuela, where I'm from, like it was really common to call people like el negro, la negra, yeah, yeah. or like anybody that was. Oh. Two shades darker than me. Yeah, and okay. it was just uh, <laughs> cultural, right? Yeah. And it wasn't ill intent at all. <laughs> Wait, so how would you use it in a sentence like in Venezuela? Like, no. Like, like somebody you... would be called el negro. Like, oh, you know un... my friend el negro. Tu What's that? that? Oh, What's that? Tu eres un negro. black person. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Tu eres un negro, so, my yeah. negro. And, and it was, um, <laughs> again, very <laughs> cultural and common. Wait, so we, wait. Can we say that? Can we say that? <laughs> That's black. Oh, don't, don't, say, don't, don't say that again. That's fine. How do you say black in Spanish? Negro. Negro. Yeah. Negro. Yeah, there you go. Negro. Negro. Like Negro. What? Negro. 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 Negro.
Doing a little oh, too much. That was like the one time. Dude, stop fucking trying to get flashlights, bro. Yeah, I'm trying to find a, a little cheat code in the same so, Relax. You know, sometimes the be- like our behavior makes sense in the context that we grew up in. Yeah. And so it isn't as, but then you you need to be able to adapt your behavior, right? And yeah. I think that's where our choice comes in. It feels like it does. It's not a conscious choice, but you want to do something about it. So that counts for something, and you have to like train yourself to rewire that um, mm. practice. Yeah. Yeah. But that's true. Well, I mean, I can't stop saying kite, so I, I can't even blame. Them. So yeah. We like, 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 yeah, it's now. It's a habit. And right. I feel bad because it, it, it's really some good Jews out there. But just because this mm-hmm. one Jew, like, it just made me say it so much. Like, yeah. I will say, I looked over our stream um, last time I was here, and I couldn't understand the amount of comments about Jews. They thought I was, which, by the way, I'm not, but I would very proudly be. <laughs> oh, thank I couldn't you. understand Everybody that was. they were making <laughs> yeah. a joke out of it. I was like, what? Yeah. Yeah. In light of what happened in October and everything, I just couldn't understand that people feel comfortable doing that. Yeah, so it's fucking crazy. I don't understand. I mean, a lot. Like, it's just. So inappropriate. Welcome to the internet. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. You should. I mean, you, you know, know what they said. Yeah, yeah, sure you don't get it. Who us? You. What do I say? say? Okay, all three. All three, all three of y'all. What do we say? Yeah, we never said no racist shit. She's a friend. Listen, for example, look, for example, for him, he'll call me a spick. He'll call me a spick, and I'll say he's a jiggable back. What? You know what? Now I'm starting to understand what you guys are talking about. Do you know what a jiggable is, though? He's not a jiggable comedy. Jesus Christ. Whoa! He's not. He's not. On my life, he's not. I'm going to look up what a jiggable means. There's a lazy black person, I think. Whoa! What? Is it not? That's how the fest is. You know what a spick is, nigga? What is a spick? Shit, I don't know. Child, what's a spick, y'all? I know it's not racist, though. Derogatory term that you shouldn't. Oh, you guys remember our little talk about like. I know that much. Oh, oh cinnamon. Yes, cinnamon. No, but then you came up with another one. It ain't no car words with me. I think no, we should, let's no, say, wait, can we change the car word to fried chicken? There has to be like, 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 and that's why off stream, you know what I it call you. It seems like you guys are constantly Yo, insulting each other. Yo, you do. He got caught up in a lot of changes, so y'all know he say it hard right now. No, 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 no. Stop. No, no. I don't okay. say that. Stop there now, chat. That's we what got saying. him. Expose okay. you. Guys are all boots, I can't. Expose you, you shaggy. You want to say something else so bad. Oh, God. You talking about my boots. These ain't even boots. Dumb ass kike. Oh, we got a whole thing out with five chickens. Everybody try it. Listen up. You guys are all insulting each other. But, um, and and I, the, the I mean, these monks, like, they the literally the just say anything. Oh, what the no, hell? So they can call me a kite, right? Oh, they they say something back. I say it. I feel like they're joking, like, ha, ha, ha. But J. Cole said it best. All good jokes contain true shit. They're wild. Don't, don't. But why not? Here's a, well, because it doesn't serve any of you well. And you don't stick up. You gotta be a better person. No, stick up for you. I stick up for you all day. Like, because we're white, we gotta be a team. Like, what do you mean stick up for him? Stick up for him. The nigga that fucked your wife, stick up for him, bro. Yes, he did. You should be over here. Oh! It was a fraudulent fraudulent lie detector. Obviously, he lied about two things, and you know it too, Shnaggy. You know it yourself. I did. He lied about two things. I do. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You know he didn't fuck my girl. I don't know. All right, whatever. But see, this how it starts. But I do have a question. Do you guys I think he did it. After all of these back and forth incidents? Nah, what if he did? I ain't gonna lie between us. No, no. but them? Yes. They, they, they did. Yeah. Yes. Okay. But yeah. you don't care when I say stuff? So? Hell no. You can call me a nigger all but, you but want. But you, you don't care? You, but okay. you guys oh, don't care. No, 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 I mean, like, no, it's no. funny. Like, no, I can't get mad. Like, what I'm gonna do? Beat his ass? This is where, like, this is my problem, man. I feel like we're getting into a point in time in today where. The word itself is being desensitized, and more and more people are feeling like okay to say it, and more and more black people is like accepting the fact that they don't care, like it's just a word. But I don't want to go down that route. I don't think we should just desensitize that word. Like a lot of a lot of a lot of us don't care. I personally, I care, but if you say it to me, I'm not going to crash out about it, you feel me? But I'm going to check you, but I'm not going to crash out about it. That's where I stand on it. Because you call me a nigger? <laughs> In defense of the chat, you guys are modeling a very shitty behavior. 
That's why they're like that, you think? Yeah. But they make us like this, too. It's yeah, like it's their fault. It's a two-way street. I That's what I called reciprocity, but no, seriously. Wait, so, Chad, did we make you this way? Is it our fault? It's their fault. It's That's their what fault. I'm saying. You see what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? So, maybe, like... They're saying yes. They're saying yes. They're saying yes. He can't say it. And the crazy part is... Also, I didn't fuck your wife. You know I didn't fuck your wife. I've never fucked her. Snaggy, the one with that hat over here talking about he could say it. No, he can't. You cannot say that, bro. <laughs> you cannot say that. Like, I personally still feel a way when I hear it. I just won't crash out behind it. That's the only difference. But there's some of us who will definitely take that charge. You're married? He's engaged. They are old oh, being. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> and the streaming yeah, world yeah, is bringing it into yeah, your yeah, life. Yeah, yeah. Like the little kids he who are watching he he streams are going to school the next day and calling people that, bro. And then the people who's the the black people who's watching, they're like, "Oh, Snaggy don't care. I don't care." Like, no, we not going down that route. <laughs> like our people went through some shit. Yeah, that's all it is. That's really what it is. He's he got the money, so and they around him, so they're like, all right, like no, that's not okay, bro. Not okay at all. And he did a lie detector test. <laughs> they found out like he said the hard R. Like, come on, man. We we not we not supporting that. We just how we were at a party and we had there was a huge 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 room with like three beds. He had one bed. I had my bed. That's it. That's, that's not what you told me. That's what not what you told me. That's not really. Right. I'll be honest. honest. I just said the truth then. I, I, know, I just got caught. Honestly, Chad, I got bad this morning. Shit happened. No, 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 no,
see? And he's like trying to make them believe it more. He was there too. Wait, 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 bro. Was there? It was Schneidy. Schneidy was on that. You was there? Fuck you, man. I was there. All right, so look, it was that one time he came to LA and you stayed. So I'm a cook. You're not a cook. No. So what the fuck? Can I explain it? It was that one time that he came to LA. Do you remember? Remember when he came to LA that first time he stayed in that apartment in Chinatown? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wasn't there then. It was you. It was you. It was you. So, it was, so you was there. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I was there. You never be on full display. You showed up. I stayed in my phone forever. Wow. The picture. I'm sorry. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? That, that one there. Wow. I gotta tell me now. Listen, oh, God. Come see you. Then look, this is my the talk. I'm going to They're bragging it. They're bragging it. Now I'm going to go home to my fiance and she's going to believe all this and say, what? So you see it came and make it too? Yeah, no. Yeah, no. You guys, oh, come on. I'm tired of this shit. Oh, God. This is a bad one. Everybody you guys see her naked. That's a good one. That's a No, it won't. It won't. Listen, you want to tell what it really was? It was a picture. It was literally a picture. You see, and Aiden keeps saying you want me to tell them what it really was, and he keeps saying it was a picture. It was a pic. He don't want the truth to get out. He don't want the truth. He panicking right now. Oh my, bro, I cry every time I laugh, bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Jesus, Jesus. Shit up, Bro. Okay, who can tell me one useful <laughs> thing that you've taken out of our conversation today? Honestly, that we're all family and friends. We're all family at the end of the day. And whatever problems for each other. Whatever problem we have, we yeah, can fix it. Out, right? That's it. Give me a hug, come. W video though. Love Do the I content. Yeah, come on, I'll get hugs. Group hug. Hug it out. Yeah, can I get a hug? Yeah, I'll watch out. I promise. Stop. Aiden, Aiden, who the fuck's your wife, bro? Cheezer. Oh, 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 I just have to test it out, too. Group up, group up, group up. Come on, group up. Bring it. Sorry, somebody here stinks, but I'm sorry. It's probably me. I don't know. It's not me. Yeah, thank you so much, Els. Yeah, Els, thank you. Oh, I like it. All right. Oh, Els,